Hey guys, Sumoto Lasal here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much guys for clicking. It's another beautiful day. We're going to talk about locks. Guys, I'm going to tell you like today I just washed my locks. And the reason why I have decided to go freeform. Freeform locks, that means I am not going to be retracing my locks very soon. As you can tell, my locks has lots of growth, lots of hair, lots of growth coming up. What have I been doing? Oh my goodness, my locks are getting thicker and I am so excited and I cannot wait to share with you. So today, I wash my locks and I am going to start styling myself putting on my makeup because as you can see guys I don't have any makeup okay but we're gonna start with the locks so I told you before in the other video I'm going to start using this Jamaican mango lime black castor oil this is the oil I'm using now the only oil that I'm using um, in my scalp at the same time I'm using water so right now I'm not gonna spray water because I already washed my locks they are dry they are so dry because I had to dry them with a towel and it's been a couple of uh, an hour or two so my locks are literally dry but I am going to apply this I love this thing because it has this uh, kind of like uh, a syringe a dropper <laughs> here's a dropper so all I do is just I go in there and try to go in there and uh, target my scalp uh -huh. look at that oh feels so good and i don't put really a lot i just want to make sure it's in there i don't forget my baby hair here everywhere and actually that's enough i don't put much because my hair is fresh when you wash your hair and go in with, with your fingertips massage 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 your locks, make sure you feel good in there. Oh my goodness, it feels so good. <sighs> okay, so this is what I've been doing. Just washing my locks. And as you can tell, guys, my locks are a little, are a little bit darker. What I did before I washed my locks, I used this black dye. This is a black dye, it's a natural dye. So you can actually use, I love this thing. So anything that quick, quick if you want your hair to be a little darker, quick, I mean, change the color. They have different colors. Or if you have the kind of person who has white hair, it's literally meant for white hair. But for me, I don't have white hair yet, <laughs> but I use it to color, just kind of make my uh, locks to kind of look darker. So I use this. I'm not sponsored, but I'm saying what I did. So I use this one first. I left it in me uh, within uh, 15 minutes and then I washed my hair. After washing my hair, I use this shampoo. I love this shampoo so much. These products I'm showing you, I am not sponsored. It's just what I use. But if they want to sponsor me, hey, I'll be so happy. So I'm using this moisture of it's a family, it's a honey coconut oil. This one was uh, suggested by my loctician. She suggested for me to use this uh, because when you use this one, it's not going to, it elongates natural oils. It's not going to stangle your hair, but it's going to help to enhance and elongate your um, natural coils. So that means if you have coils here, braids, whatever, you can use this shampoo uh, to wash uh, your, to rinse your hair. Because most people get, uh, they did really get a struggle. To kind of find the kind of uh, shampoo or to use with your locks but this one is the perfect one so I use this one after I did the dye wash my hair and then I use this honey and coconut oil and then I dried my locks with a towel and now they're dry my locks are dry and now I am using this castor oil on my locks so after I do this I think my locks looks good there's no need to style because they're already styled and I just put the uh, baby oil 
And guys, I'm just telling you what you can do. You know, naturally, you don't really need to break your bank. Even my nails, I just did my nails by myself. So you don't need to break your bank or you get your check and you run into the uh, beauty shop. Do you know how much beauty shop is? Very expensive. I used to do that, but now I am smarter. And I want you guys to be smarter with your money. Don't just be wasting your money here and there. I know beauty is necessary, but at the same time, you know, you can just go once or twice, but not like every two weeks you have to take your nails off. Oh my goodness. Now I learned how to do my own nails, okay? That's another skill. Another video for another day. So, after I do that, I feel like my locks are actually good, but I'm, my face is not okay. So, I am going to put some makeup. <laughs> That's another skill that I had to learn. You don't really, when you're doing your makeup, I'm going to put this thing just to hold my hair, my locks back, so I can put makeup, okay? So I learned, when you're putting makeup, really you don't need to be expert. Like myself, I am not expert. So I just do makeup. I just want my, my face to change, okay? So I'm using this um, bro concealer. This is the concealer. What I do with the concealer first, I put it under my eyes, like that. That's what I do. I just do it under my eyes because my eyes sometimes they look sleepy. <laughs> I come out with this beautiful, beautiful um, brush. I just tap, 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 tap. Guys, I'm looking over there because there's a huge mirror behind me than the mirror of the camera. So that one I can see. So I hope you can say like, why oh mom, are you looking like that? No, I'm using that. So. I'm gonna be so quick. This is just a quick makeup. I'm not gonna go all the steps. I'm just showing you how you can just style yourself quickly and go. As you can tell, I'm using this concealer even above my eyes. So that is exactly what I am doing. So I'm just going around my eye, okay? Mm -hmm. Guys, comment below. I know there's so many experts. This is for the newbies. If you don't know how to do your makeup, this is it. Just basic, beginner, nothing. So this is the, I know there's so many experts. Don't look at this and say, what is she doing? No, she's putting makeup, okay? <laughs> she is a newbie. So guys, I'm not that expert on this. So after I do this, I come up with this makeup, guys. I got this makeup from uh, one of the beauty shop. It's, uh, <clears throat> it's a 60D. Yes, it's a, it's a foundation together with a concealer. So this one, what I like about this makeup is like they have this thing right here. So all I do the makeup, I don't want to put too much makeup on. I don't ever like too much makeup on me. So I, I do some dots right here. Just kind, you know. And I come up with a brush. I have two brushes here, but I'm going to use a wider brush to kind of go circle. When I do my makeup... I tend to go in a circle, circle motion, one direction. This side I go clockwise. This side I go anti-clockwise. So that's what I'm doing. <laughs> and this side I go this way. Guys, do you do your makeup that way? Because I feel like when you do it um, this way, it's just quick way for you to rush. You don't need, if I sit here, and they start doing makeup oh my goodness it's gonna take a long time because i have to put the concealer you have to come with this so this one is my go-to uh, makeup it's just a quick makeup work uh, makeup quick you know appointment you don't need really to sit and don't forget your neck because your neck is part of your face because you can imagine putting makeup here and then you forget your neck right <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look good so guys as you can tell my face is already changed I can already see my face looking so pretty so all I need is this one actually I don't need to put much I have a lot I can use the powder I can use uh, the sponge I can use all kinds but I have this one here I can use all this but I don't want to use that today I just want to use a brush and my concealer plus my foundation uh, that's it that's it they say two in one two in one so you put it once you're done so that's what i'm gonna do basically so if you don't know how to do makeup like myself don't struggle don't just beat you you can do it so look at my face 
my face looks fresh so when i finish with this i come up with my um let me see i come up with my lipstick of course i have to put lipstick there's so many kinds of lipstick out there this is papoish a j2 uh, lipstick a j2 lipstick this one i got it from a beauty shop you can get your color but for me i like the color that fits my skin i don't want to put red or bright colors no i want something that looks actually like my skin and i found this color is really really good so and that's another thing you can do when you're going to buy your makeup or your lipstick make sure you find the lipstick that at, at least looks like your skin because i hate when i see people putting makeup they they just look like clowns and they have too white and too dark or too red or too medium you know find something that is gonna coordinate with your skin like this one this lady chooses for me the foundation she gave it to me she tested on my skin first and then we said yes this is gonna uh, fit your skin so when i finish Guys, as you can tell, my face is all looking good. I don't want to put in eyelashes and color because I don't put eyelashes because whenever I put my eyelashes, my eyes tend to swell. I don't know why. So I stopped putting in uh, eyelashes on my extension, whatever. I don't want to do that. So when I come, I come with this brush right here and try to comb my eyelashes because my eyelashes are really big. So I close my eyes and down here and of course I need to do this my eyebrows <laughs> guys I love my eyebrows sometimes when I go to uh, sometimes I do go to I do my eyebrows by myself and because I'm trying to learn to do anything by myself I'm trying to cut coast i'm trying to be natural if i go i go once but everything i just want to do by myself okay i feel like it's a skill that everybody needs to learn at some point <laughs> so when i do that i comb the front area and then i come with this thing i slide down you see you see how they're lining up you may think that i went to a salon and somebody did my eyelashes but i know they did not it's me so this is the trick i use all the time but if i see that my eyebrows are not lining up or they've been a very long time that's when i go they fix it for me and then i can go for months by just doing it myself so if you can do that i tell you you will save a lot of coins guys what do you think I look pretty if I want to put my earrings whatever I can but for now because I don't want to put anything where I'm going really it's not somewhere that I need to doll myself so all I do is come here my locks are ready and your girl over here can just scoop a little bit just to look like that so you can tell your girl she is so ready to go to the party guys i'm going to the party <laughs> i'm going to change though i'm not going with this uh short i'm going to change but i just wanted to show you how i can quickly do my uh, locks and wash it and, and and put my makeup without spending a whole lot of money how i can do my nails quickly so it's just the whole thing you can take even 20 minutes 20 or 30 minutes i'm done okay <laughs> thank you so much guys i just wanted to see you or show you how you can be economical okay i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye